Hello guys and girls, it's Snap Jack here with the Giants Clan Central and today we'll be having a look at the very new but fucking hard game called Prison Architect. Now this game, just wow, I've played this game to within an inch of its life recently. It's so freaking amazing. Basically the game consists of one goal which is to build a fully functional mega prison. Now there are two ways you can go about doing this. One being that you make the inmates lives live in hell and they'll start writing and all wonderful shit happens. The other being that you'll be more humane and look after their well-being. Now the footage that you can see I may have cheated a bit with the money because um, it's real hard to control this and this is one of the biggest parts of the game and I just thought in purpose of the video that I'll just add some money so yeah that's why that's there. Now going back to the money, it's really really hard to control. Um, every day you receive more inmates, normally eight to twelve. More and more every day, you just keep getting it. it takes ages for them to go away as well, so with the sentences that they receive. Um <laughs> yeah. Can be a real pain in the ass, especially when you're bankrupt and everybody's right and no no guards because you can't buy any. Um and all wonderful stuff ha stuff happens. As you can see, the many different types of rooms that you can select, um, the cells, offices, all stuff like that for people to work and live in. Um, and the AI is incredibly intelligent. Now, as much as this game don't look like it's demanding, trust me, my com I built an absolutely massive um, prison earlier, and my computer just like crashed. I mean, this is obviously an issue with the game because I have a really good computer and I was surprised myself really. But yeah, this probably cost it AI is absolutely incredible. Each one has their own individual personalities and um, knows what they're doing really. It's, it can be a bit buggy but <laughs> I'm not complaining because it's good. You now you can see you can choose different objects to meet the living requirements as well. Putting some benches down. And utilities, now this is a big part of the game, you have to supply power and water to all different types of appliances and um, this can be a bit of arse rot as well but um, yeah it's a fact of the game and I think it's a really good one. Um, you have to have a power station and a um, water pump, yeah, that's what word. Um, it's quite expensive if you're doing it legit, um, <laughs> yeah but Sure, I'll get around eventually. I mean, it took me quite a few tries to get used to the control and things, but <laughs> I got there in the end. You can see here the regime. Um, this is a factor with um, you can unlock and um, yeah, you can change what time the prisoners do what so like say if they've all started rioting at a certain point if you realised it swap it around a bit and change it um, and you can see we can upgrade things um, unlock different characters so you can use them in game which is quite a cool um, feature I think lots of different tabs here but yeah and grants them um, yeah, you can if you're really struggling for money and you want to build like an extra wing to um, house all your prisoners what I'm looking for you can unlock it through grants now the, what it basically does is the government on the game obviously supplies you with money to complete the task now the um, only problem is with that if you don't complete the task then you're pretty screwed over but anyway yeah there's loads yeah, like the, I've said with the rooms, loads of different types of kitchens, cells. And um, here you can see I'm building a bigger kitchen because I'm just not feeding enough prisoners. But, um, yeah, I just really, really like this game. And um, it, as non complex as it looks, it really is. Um, you can download it. I'm not too sure how much it is to buy. Um, I didn't get this, my mate got it for me. <laughs> I didn't even know about it until I got me it. But um, yeah, I think it's a really good game, and it's worth a try or just at least demo if there is one. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it as much as I do, because um, as you can see, it's really, really good. And um, I know it's pixelated, but <laughs> that I can live with. 
think it makes it better, honestly. Not too realistic. Makes it fun. And guys, thanks for watching. This has been Sniper Giant again with the Giants Clan Central. Um, likes, comments, subscribes, whatever. It's all good. Um, supports us in a way. So yeah, we're just trying our best, really. Um, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed. There's still some extra footage left. I'll just let you watch it and stop talking myself. And um, this has been, yeah. Again, this has been <laughs> Sniper Giant, and thanks for watching.